Dennis, yeah. you just told me you're not homeless, you're structurally challenged. That's true. <laughs> I like that. <laughs> tell me, tell me, tell me your story. You come here from work and... Yeah, I uh, ran out of work uh, in Salem, Oregon. And the word was always that uh, you can find work in Phoenix. And so I was about ready to lose my car, which I had bought brand new. Did some praying and came up with the idea of coming down here and finding a job. And I got down here and realized the economy was just as bad as Oregon, and then uh, developed a uh, muscle disorder. I knew something was wrong with my arms. I just thought that they would get better. But I have a condition called multifocus motor neuropathy, which is really rare. Uh, what it does is basically stops my, my arms and hands from working. So I have to go in for treatments once a month. So what's your future? Pretty bleak. I, I don't think I'm... i got to go back to see the doctor next week. Probably definitely going to fall under the dis, you know, disabled act. And uh, I just, I've, I've never been there, so I don't, I don't know exactly what's going to happen. Did you ever think you would be structurally challenged? No, I, I'm 53, so I've worked all my life. Uh, got my first full-time job when I was 15. A lot of people in my age bracket uh, have never known going without work or not having the ability to at least rent an apartment and have your own car. If you had three wishes, what would they do? Well, if my muscle disorder would go away, uh, get a job and go back to so-called normal life. But one, one more. One, one more wish. That was three. Was it? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> I'm a drummer. We don't know how to count. Hey, thanks very much for talking to me. You're welcome.